All right, Shalom, Shalom, Yasharalo. This is another GMS Riley collaboration once again through the Spirit Power Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. I'm the brother Nakwam. I'm the brother Nakwam. And before we go any further with this Lord's with an edifying lesson, we want to give all honor and all glory and all praises to our Heavenly Father and to His only begotten Son, Yahweh. Yahweh. Bahashim. Bahashim. Yahweh Shah. Yahweh Shah. Bahashim. Rakakadash. And next up, double honors to our apostles and other bishops of Great Millstone, who still got there in the highways and hedges and feed us with 100% truth according to the Bible and Ruel. And Shalawan to all the Akims that's out there in the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth in the name of Yahweh Bashim Shah out of fear and sincerity of heart. You know, and this lesson is pretty much going to go into that there is no free will, man. Contrary to popular belief, you know what I'm saying? According to the Bible, there is no free will. You can't pick and choose what you want to do in this life because it's all controlled by the Lord, man. So you can break out your first piece up, brother. Con. This is Proverbs chapter 24. 20. So like it. Mm -hmm. This is Proverbs chapter 20, verse 24. Mm -hmm. Man's goings are of the Lord. Yahweh Bashim was shot. Yep. How can a man then understand his own way? Now that word goings right there, it goes into steps. Okay, so a man's steps are of the Lord, man. You see, meaning Yahweh Bashim Shah, who the world ignorant calls God and Jesus Christ, are the ones that's uh being the puppet master and taking their and controlling everybody's thoughts and doings, man. You see? So you can't, so we can't understand our own way and neither can the majority of these people because it's all programmed by Yahweh Bashim Shah. Read that over again and get that Job. Yep. This is Proverbs chapter 20, verse 24. Yep. Man's goings are of the Lord. Yep. Yahweh Bashim Shah. Mm -hmm. How can a man then understand his own way? Right, yeah. So, you, you know, you think he can direct your steps uh, you, you planning a day, thinking you're going to do this, thinking you're going to do that. But the Lord, if it's not of the Lord's, you know what I'm saying, plan, okay, or if it's will, you know, that's going to change, man. The Lord's going to have you do something completely different than you thought you was going to do, you see? Because Yahweh Bashim Shah, who the world even because God and Jesus Christ are the ones that's programming uh, our minds, man, to do what we do and to say what we say. Was that it in that, brother? That's right. So go to that next one, Baba Kasha. This is Job chapter 33, verse 15. Mm -hmm. In a dream, in a vision of the night, mm -hmm. when the sleep falleth upon men and slumbering upon the bed. Which is going into their realm sleep. You see, R E uh, M, rapid eye movement, that realm sleep, man. This is what Yahweh Bashim Asha is doing while we in that deep sleep. You know what I'm saying? Read on. Verse 16. Then he openeth the ears of men mm -hmm. and sealeth their instructions. And sealeth their instructions, man. You see? For an example, you know, somebody that uh, commits a whole lot of deletions, man. It was the Lord that put the spirit on that individual, all right, to make him go out there in the public and delete a lot of people, man. You see, for with these shootings and with uh these 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 car wrecks and all that, that was all programmed by Yahweh Bashim Asha, because the Lord put it in their spirit to do that. All right, so there is no free will, okay? Because the person just don't wake up and that's on their minds. You know, it's in the first thing. You know, that's all of the Lord. That was it on that. Just a little bit more. Mm -hmm. It says, verse 17, it says that he may withdraw man from his purpose and have pride for men. Mm -hmm. That's oh, it on that. God, the point has been made, you know, hey, the Lord still of the instructions, man. You know, the Lord is the one that's doing the programming of our minds, man, to make us do what we do, whether it's good or whether it's evil. Go to that next one, Baba Kasha. Uh -huh. 
Whatever you got, you can bring out that Proverbs 16 or that James, it don't matter. This is Jeremiah chapter 10, verse 23. Okay. Oh Lord, Yahweh mm -hmm. was shy. Mm -hmm. I know that the way of man is not in himself. Right, yeah, the way of man is not of himself, man. That's why we started off with Proverbs 20 and 24, that the Lord um, directs the steps of man. You see? How can a man then understand his own way? So there's no free will, man. You see? Just like as the disciples, you know what I'm saying? That Lord Yahweh chose. You see? It, they just didn't up and, 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 uh, and decided to follow the Lord. The Lord programmed them to do that, man. You see? That's why Lord Yahweh says, Ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you. You see? So it was all the spirit and the calling of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. You know? This, this is Jeremiah chapter 10, verse 23. Mm -hmm. Oh Lord, I know that the way of man is not in himself. Yep. It is not in man that walketh to direct his steps. Right, because the Lord directs our step, man. See, the Lord is the ultimate puppet master. All right? The Lord is the one that's controlling us to do what we do. You know? Just like as you, you know, you, you play a video game, you know what I'm saying? Whatever you um, do on your analog stick or your arrows, it controls the character of what they do. You know, so that's Yahweh Bashim Shah, you know, the creator. That was it or not? Mm hmm. Bring out that next one. Yep. This is Proverbs chapter 16, verse 9. Mm hmm. A man's heart. Devises his way. Right, a man's heart devises his way. Now the word heart, go back to the Hebrew word lot, which means a mind. So the man's heart devises, which means to plot or to plan his way. So you might plan to do something throughout the day. You might have an actual schedule written down, but the Lord can completely change that, man. You know, and we had that happen. You know, you have something written down to what you was going to do. You have a uh, a list. You know, and the Lord will either add or he'll take away an activity that you was going to do. All right? Because it's all the will of the Lord. Read on. Read on. But the Lord, Yahweh Bashamal Shai, the wreck of his steps. Right, the wreck of his steps, man. It's all of the Lord, man. You see? So, you know, this this whole world doctrine of uh, we chose the Lord and we got the... Uh, the, the, the liberty to choose what we want to do in life, that's that's not according to the Bible because it's all of Yahweh Bashim al Shah's will, okay, to uh do what we do. Like Psalms 115 and 3 says, Our power is in the heaven, he have done whatsoever he have pleased, man. So if it, so it pleases the Lord, you know what I'm saying, to control us whether we do good or whether we do evil, man. It's plain and simple. You got that? You got uh, you, that was it on that, my brother? Uh, Go to that next one, Baba Kasha. Uh, excuse me. With that, uh, that James. Uh -huh. This is James chapter 4, verse 15. Mm -hmm. For that ye ought to say, if the Lord will. Mm -hmm. We shall live mm -hmm. and do this or that. And you know what? And that's a humble characteristic, man. You see? That's why we always say, Lord's willing, we'll do this. Lord's willing, we'll do that. Lord's willing, we'll do this later. You see? You know? It's all over Yahweh Bashim Shah's will, man. You see? That we do this or that we do that, you know? It's all of the Lord because the Lord is the one that's controlling our steps. You know, he, like I said earlier, he's the ultimate puppet master, man. You see? So that's why we always say Lord is willing, man, you know, for everything, you know, that we do. Read that one more time, Baba Kasha. Mm-hmm. Uh, James chapter 4, verse 15. Mm -hmm. For ye, for, for that ye ought to say, if the Lord will, we shall live yep. and do this or that. That's right, yep. And see, we better say that all throughout the day. You know? If brothers uh, you know, plan to do something, we'll be like, all right, brother, Lord's willing we do that. All right, or Lord's willing we'll do that later. You see? It's cause we it's all of the will of Yahweh by Shema Sha, Yahweh by Shema Sha, who the world even goes God and Jesus Christ are the ones that's controlling our lives, man. 
So if we want to do something and we want it to go according to plan, we always say if it's of the Lord's will, you know, Lord's willing. That was it on that, brother. Do you want verse 16? Um, no, no, that was pretty much the point through the spirit. Right. Yeah, that was pretty much the point. So, hey, Lord's windows is edifying through the spirit. Pay y'all by Shema, Shah by Shema, Kakodash. Just to me and the brother to uh, come with another Lord's with an edifying video. Lord's windows. Till next time, we say Shalom. Shalom.